it's a little bit wet and cloudy today, but I hope you have a great day. I have for you colorful design and I'm starting with two layers of human modesty color as my background. And each layer is of course cured in the lamp. Then using very thin brush, Jessica's Choice, I'm drawing a kind of, let's say, dripping juice. And I'm gonna use then multicolored ne neon colors. Once I kind of sketched with a white liner gel the design, I used detailer number three brush and blended it a little bit. So then the borders of the design were not so sharp. And just a bit blend. Then that actually will be very good background for my colors. And the colors that I'm using is royal blue, neon yellow, neon green and neon pink. And I'm starting with neon yellow. That white liner gel background I cured in the lamp for about 30 seconds. Then I applied yellow neon color and I blend as you can see. Then I flash cured it in the lamp just for literally 5 seconds. Next I mixed the yellow and pink together and I got some sort of orangey color and then I applied the pink and each time I cured it in the lamp just for a few seconds and as you can see the design is getting now some color then I mixed a royal blue with pink and I got a very nice um, purpley color and I applied it on the bottom of the design. And then on the tip of each, I added a bit of neon green and just blend it all together. But I decided that there's not enough color and I added two more drops with green neon color and tiny bit of yellow with that. Then I mixed a bit of pink and the green together and it was kind of dirty color and I added a bit of also that royal blue because I wanted to make a little shadow on the side of the design just like this then I clear the clean the brush with a dry wipe and using matte top coat I blend it all with the background it's not so much shadow you can repeat it but I just wanted to see if I can add a little bit more definition to the design all of that was cured in the lamp. Then I used a little bit of matte top coat and applied magic flakes. It's a mix of um, glitters that have different sizes and I just wanted to apply some bling bling on the bottom of the design. It's a collection of five colors. Okay, so that went to the lamp just for a few seconds, then applied matte top coat and again to the lamp. I wiped off the sticky layer and using gemstone gel I wanted to my design to have a bit of 3D effect. So I applied the gemstone gel in all the drops and using detailer number 3 brush I spread it all over the colorful design. That went to the lamp was cured and because gemstone gel doesn't have much shine on its own I wanted it to be really shiny. So I applied Supreme Finish and that went to the lamp. At the end, the white liner gel for definition and finishing touches of the design. I hope you like it. I wish you a lovely Sunday. Bye bye!